In this tutorial, we'll look at how to fix npm start bug in React. All right, so I have a couple of solutions for you. The first option that you have to, to fix this is to simply remove the node modules folder. So you can just right click and delete this and it's gonna take some time because it's a huge folder. Now at some point it's uh, removed and then what you can do, you can open your terminal and you're simply gonna run npm install. Right, so just install everything again. It's gonna look at the package.json to see which packages it needs to install, but this will make sure that everything as it relates to node modules has been installed properly. Um, and for a lot of people, this seems to solve it. So make sure you try out this solution and I'll wait until it's finished. Okay, so eventually it should have installed everything again and you can try running npm start again. And it's, it's using React script, right? So um, if it's still not working, and let me just close out of here. If it's still not working, then uh, try installing React scripts. So you can just write npm install React scripts and see if that solves it, right? So it's gonna take some time and then you can try again. If all of that hasn't solved it, the last option you may wanna try is create a .env file, right? This is what people use for environment variables. And one of the options that seems to work is to set skip preflight check to true. Right, so we're setting this variable here, no quotation marks, and save the file here, open your terminal again, and run um, npm start again and see if that works. Right, So th th one of those solutions should solve your issue. By the way, if this was helpful, I'd really appreciate it if you could like and subscribe. Also, check out my courses on CSS and JavaScript if you want to take those skills to an advanced level. Because in there, we will build some beautiful real-world projects from scratch so you can see how everything fits together and really master CSS or JavaScript. And I will also release other courses soon like React and Node.js. So if you want to be notified, then make sure you are subscribed to the email newsletter. You can find the link in the description. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you soon.